Hello everybody, Gamer Penny here bringing you a brand new series for our YouTube channel. We are going to be playing through a game called Monster Hunter Rise. <laughs> this is our character, Vesper Valentina, same as in Final Fantasy. Uh, she looks really nice in this game. <laughs> um, but I'm really excited to play this. So I have something to admit is that I played around 300 hours of Monster Hunter World. So when Rise came out, Dear. I was. Looks like we've been caught in the action, Hold on. Yoto. Quite disappointing, <laughs> Hinoa. I really don't see how anyone could have noticed us. It was a perfect display of stealth. That's why we expect great things of you. You're always razor sharp. Creepy. Well then, I guess we still have a lot of training left to do. <sighs> what? You don't want us sneaking in? Oh come on! This is Kimura. We're all practically family here. Besides, Elder Fugen is looking for you. Elder Fugen, So go get huh? ready. Can't keep him waiting. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, here we are. We're the human. <laughs> um. Ah, uh, there we are in our outfit. Beautiful. Okay, Pasa. Shall we go? Hmm. I wonder what that monster is. Yay! Monster Hunter Rise! Okay, so as I was saying, I had about 300 hours in Monster Hunter Worlds as an insect glaive <laughs> main. Um, I, I was thinking of, of doing an insect glaive for Monster Hunter Rise. Uh, I don't know if I really want to. <coughs> in fact, I, I gave the insect glaive a test out. Um, played a few hours of it on here. I played a few hours of another weapon that I think we're actually going to go with um, instead. So it was kind of practice to learn because uh, it's really painful watching someone learn a weapon for the first time <laughs> sometimes. Oh. So I wanted to come in prepared. So that being said, I did not make it very far. I didn't make it past Hunter Rank 2 on either of those characters. So. Elder Fugen, we did like you asked. We're going to be playing oh. this one together. Minoa. Minoto. Thank you. I just got an important letter. Yeah. It looks like we've got a rampage on our hands. Uh. So it's finally beginning. Hmm. It's been 50 years since the last calamity. But I remember like it was yesterday. A horde of monsters, the ramp. A huge pack of <laughs> monsters in a giant stampede. They attack the village in a frenzied rage. Nobody knows why this happens, but it came close to that wiping a spider out monster our village last time. On the left there. I'm not a fan. <laughs> I think it's time. We paid a visit to the stronghold. We have to protect the village. The stronghold? There's nothing to worry about, Elder Fugen. All of us, everyone in Kimura, we've all been training for this moment for our entire lives. Hm. Hinoa, we should start preparations right away. Hm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Now that's what I like to hear. Does he have fangs? <laughs> he does. <laughs> He's part monster, man. Oh no. Please stop laughing like that. Alright, now, Vesper Valentina, rampage and all aside, I've got news for you. Got a message from the guild this morning, says that you are now a certified hunter. You're really living now, Squirt. Well, I guess I shouldn't call you that now you're certified, but don't think it'll stop me. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt, Elder Fugen. I've informed the village of the coming rampage like you asked. Uh -huh. Ah, yes, thank you. Congratulations. By the way, Vesper Valentina, I overheard the good news. You're finally an official hunter? Wow, congratulations. Uh -huh. All you need to do now is register with the guild so you can start accepting all those quests. To do that, you need to speak with Master 
Hojo in the Gathering Hub. But that can wait. First, we go shopping. Ah. You'll be needing the help of our other villagers if you want to succeed out in the field. Yeah. So, follow me. Let's start there. Now, where should we start? Uh -huh. Aha, of course. The Marketeer of Mystery. Kagero the Merchant. Alright, I'm going to be skipping most of the tutorials. Um... And also probably some of the dialogue, like this guy. Because the tutorial in this game is uh, intense. <laughs> and I've played through it. And most of it is typical Monster Hunter. So I'll explain along the way. Okay. Okay, yes. Alright, so, to two guys we just talked to, shop, he offers a lottery at some point, um, and the smithy, which we will be making use of him to craft weapons and armor based on the monsters that we kill. Um, and this is where we eat delicious food. Okay. I really... If you're watching for the story, you are in the wrong, uh... Ron video thing here. <laughs> so cool. Mm. Go visit okay. The hub. Come on. I think I have to talk to this guy first before I can ch change my weapon. We're not doing lawn sword. Uh, I know we have a lawn sword on now, but that's what the game starts you with. I'm not doing that. I'm doing something. Uh, lawn sword's fun. Oh. But I'm doing something that I. It was too timid to try okay. in world. And when I did, I just failed horribly at it. <laughs> but I think I got the hang of it uh, playing... I played like four hours of this, I think. Um, using that weapon, and uh, I really enjoy it. Oh no. Alright, we'll read this one. Well, hello there, Vesper Valentina. You sure, look for it. sure took forever to get here. I thought I was gonna croak. Oh ho ho. You're probably well aware that I, Hojo, am the guild master of this exceptional gathering Indeed. hub. What's that? Your guild registration? Oh yes, well I was getting to it, to it, before you interrupted me. Had you let me finish, I would have told you that we no longer do things that way. Get with it, with it, young hunter. Jo -ho -ho -ho. Ah. No test to take or papers to stamp, just my okay and you're on your way. And with that, you are now officially a hunter. Not just any hunter, no, a hunter of Kamura Village. Accept a quest from our dearest Minoto and go hunt some monsters. Jo -ho 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 -ho. About that, as much as I'd like to, I have this to get this report about the rampage ready for the guild. I'm terribly sorry, but could you take talk to Hanoa first so she can explain quests to you? Huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's go talk to this guy real quick. Hey um, so Monster Hunter you. games, I know, <laughs> are pretty much grindy. <laughs> um... Where's our camera? If it isn't Kimura's brightest flame. Later. Uh, they're grindy games, so this one doesn't have much of a story. Um, at least not yet. I think they're probably gonna add it in later. But you're basically hunting monsters to get parts to craft your gear. Um, so it's it's more of a grind than anything. Um, I don't know how hey, far. Listen. We'll end up take. Did someone hey listen me? Let's go. All right, we're gonna hop on our dog and run. <laughs> All this work is making me hungry. How are you today? Oh, Vesper Valentino, already completed your hunter registration. Great. I retrieved your kahoot from Elder F Fugen earlier. It is so cute. You're gonna yeah. love it. Okay, I I don't care about this. Huh? The, like I said, like all all of this is tutorial, which this game has so much tutorial. Uh, it's a little ridiculous. Whoops. Yeah, fine. He can be mm. Kahoot. I don't. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. All right. Got it. All right. We'll go talk to you. <laughs> Okay. This is how we do multiplayer, which we will be doing. Um, okay. Oh my gosh, so much tutorial. All right, let me grab my add-on content. 
I don't have a lot, but uh, it's gonna help out a little bit. Accept all. And then, uh, what I also want to do is go choose our weapon. Uh, so I know I'm moving through this really fast, and I really appreciate your your patience putting up with it. It's if I didn't move this fast through this, uh, this would be we're already ten minutes in. But this would take the full <laughs> the full episode, and I want to get out and uh, experience the game, you know. This is a training area. Greetings and salutations. Alright, yep, I know. It's showing, introducing me to everything, huh? Jesus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, um, from here, I'd very much like to go pick what weapon we're going to be using. I'm gonna go to the training area to do that so I can show you a little bit. So this is the training area. If you play this game or are thinking of picking it up, uh, you can come here and fight a stationary monster that doesn't fight back, basically, to get used to using the different moves. Um, I spent a lot of time in here with this weapon that we're about to choose, uh, and I think I got it down for the most part. <laughs> I'm no expert, but I'm having a lot of fun with it, so. Oh my god, Tutorial City. Okay. Here's what I want to do. Go to the item box. Manage equipment. Change equipment. They give you every weapon that's in the game. Uh, they start you with the lawn sword. It's okay to start with. It's gonna feel clunky though. Um, for someone new starting. Great sword's good. The two that I would recommend if you're just starting out would be sword and shield or even dual blades. Um, would be really good as a starter. Hammer is pretty fun as a starter. Um, I, like I said, in, in World, I had like 300 hours of Insect Glaive. The only thing with Insect Glaive is uh, it's a lot of aerial, like flipping around up in the air type doing stuff. And I'm not very good at aiming, so I do a lot of just like whiffing. <laughs> like just missing the boss and stuff. So. Uh, as I was trying to figure out, I was considering bow, I was considering charge blade, um, I was considering actually dual blade, but what I'm gonna land on here is the hunting horn. <laughs> um, the hunting horn is a unique weapon in that not only does it deal damage, but it buffs your party members. And since I'm gonna be doing a lot of um, multiplayer stuff, jumping in with other people's quests. I wanted to have something that's really good with multiplayer. Um, I, I played around with it a little bit to see if it was something that would potentially be okay to solo through the game. I was doing better with the hunting horn than I was the insect claim. <laughs> so, what do we got going on here? So this is our, our horn. That's me taking it out, buffing myself, so I perform, and uh, you see up in the corner I've got self-improvement, self so I self-improve myself. Um, if I hit with X two times, I'll give the entire party a buff up of attack, or of defense. If I hit with A two times, they get a buff up of attack. If I do X and A together, with this weapon, we get health recovery. Um, there's also a, like, recital move that we can do, which is Z and X, which is huge, you see that. <laughs> um, and then let's see if we can build up our gauge here, and I'll show you another move that we're gonna be able to do. Um, another t key tip that I learned is if you do X and A, first you swing backwards. So what I was doing is I was running up to monsters, turning around and hitting it, so that I swing backwards, because that backwards hit actually does a crap ton of damage. The only thing is if you combo it into something, you get going backwards, but we can easily fix that. Okay. Um, up in the... Oops. 
up in the uh, left hand corner, you'll see where my melodies are being played. You'll see what buttons I'm pressing. Um, you'll also see a little purple circle that's forming around our, our horn there. I'm waiting for that to fill up so I can show you. There we go. So it's filled, filled up now. Let's sharpen our, our horn. I don't know why it needs to be sharpened, but... So I also have a finisher that's ready to go. So let's finish it. And then at the end of it, if I press it again, we have an expert finisher that gives us, like, the ultimate buff. Um, what else can we do? Oh, the other cool thing is, in this game, you've got, uh, these bugs that you collect. Uh, we have a pretty cool one where, it's at the bottom of the screen, I've got two little bug right in the middle. Bug icons. Uh, if those two are full, I'm able to do a pretty cool... Connect and just mega damage to them. Earth shatter there. Um, and then we gotta wait for the bugs to recharge. So... It's a cool weapon. I'm having a lot of fun playing it. Um, I didn't. I didn't do my. Up there. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. All right. Sick. So the thing is, this original weapon gives you self improvement. They all have. Gives you defense up, attack up, and then health recovery. Um, depending on your weapon, those are going to change. The only one that stays the same is that self-improvement. So we're going to be able to play around with it. I haven't done a whole lot of playing around with what the other weapons are and what they give. Um, so we'll have fun. We'll have fun figuring that out and kind of min-maxing. So yeah, this is what I'm going with. Hunting horn. Those were the basic moves, just a little bit of a rundown of them. Uh, we won't be using a whole lot of them in these first quests, because I don't think we're hunting anything too big. Um, in the first quest, actually, I don't think we hunt anything in the first quest. <laughs> but, um, I've been trying to figure out... So at the top of the right-hand screen, you see village progress and hub progress. I've been trying to figure out what the difference between those two are. Um, village progress is like, I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know uh -huh. what exactly the difference is. The hub progress is, mm. I can jump in on other players' mm. quests, and we, we do multiplayer, so I like that the best. Well. Alright, then you have these optional quests that you can pick up five at a time. So let's do, um, these five. Uh, whoops. And then you have the main quest. So we gotta do back to basics here. And this is not going to be a hard quest at all. It's gonna teach you the basics of Monster Hunter. It's another tutorial, basically. Um, before you go on quests, you usually want to sit here and eat to get some buffs going. Uh, we don't have to do that for this one. Because we're not fighting anything. Uh, we're fighting little monsters. So yeah, that's what I've gathered so far in my four hours of playing. <laughs> so, um, like I said, I'm sorry I went through that whole beginning early or er, really fast. These halls of worship, once so bustling. But also, we're 18 minutes in, and uh, now home to monsters, stalking and rustling. That would have taken us the entire episode. So. Hunters, beware. Not wait, but despair. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Alright, here we are. Yo, my favorite pupil. Yo, Ace, what's up? Accepted my quest, huh? Nice. Come over here and we'll get started. Alright. And there is a time limit. In the beginning, they're not too bad time limits, and they're very easily done. If it isn't Kimura's brightest flame. Congrats again on making Hunter. A whole new life awaits. I can see it in your eyes that you're ready to thrash, but let's do a little qu quest refresher first, cool? Let's start with our camp here. Uh -huh. This is your tent. Here you can change your equipment and weapons or organize your items. If you want to bail in your current loadout, you're free to switch out your gear instead. Yeah. 
That over there is the supply box. It's full of useful items that'll aid you during a quest. And everything in there is provided by the guild, so feel free to take and use whatever you want. And that's it for the camp. Let's move on to the next part. I'll meet you down by the river, past the ledge. If you get lost, just look for my icon on your map. Alright. Okay, I don't want these dang tutorials. Just every everyday tutorial. Okay. I'm gonna take the free stuff, because why not, huh? Then we'll go ahead and slide down here. Oh. I was gonna to Oh my god, I, I'm so tired of tutorials. <laughs> like, every two steps. Alrighty. Tutorials upon tutorials. Hey, up here! Alright, let's talk wire bugs. These bodacious bugs are a must in any hunt. Use them right and you'll be able to zip around to pretty much anywhere you want to go. Even on top of this boulder. Give it a shot! Alright. Me up there. There we go. To see you. Look at that. You're a natural. Next, let's talk buddies. Mm. Today, I brought my palico and palamut, Flash and Rumble, with me. Right. They'll be lending you a paw for uh, this part of the training. First, try mounting Rumble, my palamut. <laughs> Palamutes are swift as the wind, so if a monster gives you a slip, hop on your barking buddy. All right, I'll be waiting for you up the trail. Meet me there. Give it a try. All right. Listen up. Riding the Palamute. I'm gonna grab some stuff as we're going. Uh, you don't have to grab all this stuff, and honestly, you don't need to, but I really like to grab, like, any sort of item that I see around here so that we have a good stockpile. Is this poop? Dung. Herbs and whatnot. Alright. Hey, hero. Hey, check this out. A uh, yellow spear bird. If you touch one, its pollen will enhance that good luck charm you're wearing. Your petalus. When that happens, the scent of the pollen surrounds your petalus and boosts your stats. Since this little guy is yellow, it'll increase your stamina. Similarly, spirit birds of other colors will boost other stats. Pretty gnarly, if you ask me. The effect is only active during the current quest, but you can be sure as shurikens that they are worth using. Oh, and that's a cloth fly over there. Cloth flies are one of many creatures you'll come across out in the field. We call these little guys endemic life. The powder these floaty friends spread can boost your defenses. Mm. There's lots of other endemic life out there that can boost your hunts in different ways. <laughs> have a look around for other endemic life and then play around with them and see what kind of effects they have. Okay, just a little bit more. Follow me. Alright. So that boosted our stamina. This gives us some defense. I'm going to collect these bones. This thing's pretty cool. Flashbang! <laughs> so if a monster was there, we would have flashed him. Uh, and he would have been blinded by the light. Hey. I've been waiting for you. Right on, Ace. Got a hang of the riding palamutes already? They're super helpful buddies, especially when you need to cover a lot of ground. And you can even tell them to attack while you're riding them. But their attacks won't be as strong as yours. Mm. So when you're ready to get down to business, it's best to dismount. <laughs> oh, look! Looks like we got ourselves some monsters nearby. Mm -hmm. How are your health and stamina looking? Be sure to keep tabs on your status while out in the field. Oh, okay. I'm tired of tutorials. <laughs> Alright, I know we want to dismount, but, uh... Yo, my favorite Gnarly, a pack of Azuchi. Let's go kill them. Um... Bum, 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 bum. I don't draw my weapon using X. I draw my weapon using ZR so that I get the self-improvement right away. Excellent. Okay, one down. Where'd you go? That's there my you go. And would you like to get this guy? Okay. <laughs> awesome. Uh, don't forget to carve. Alright, and so any monster that you kill, even the little ones, you can actually carve them for their parts. So on that guy, we got a sharp claw. Flashbang! <laughs> um, on this guy, we will get... Where's the third one that we got? Zuchi Pelt. Did I get screwed out of my third one? 
One, two. Oh, he's further up. Okay, I'm also gonna stop and get this. Honey! Good job! Hmm, don't mind me. Okay, and another Izuchi pal. All right, we good? Hey, hero. Just I expect to start uh -huh. people. Now let's head back to camp. Fast travel, great. Um, map. Fast travel, main camp. All right. Thirty minutes in. Ready to thrash? Tutorial mm. over. Mm. Kinda. There we go. <laughs> That tutorial is intense, so again, apologies for sort of racing through that, but we would have been here forever and ever. Uh, just reading through all that, and it's stuff I already know. Another great hunt. Oh, high five, huh? Hm. Um, a lot of it's very similar to the other Monster Hunter games. I've played two other ones. I played Monster Hunter Generations. Uh, on the Nintendo DS a little bit. I, I didn't get really far in it or learn a whole lot. <laughs> so when I picked up Monster Hunter World, it was like learning everything really for the first time. And there's a lot. I mean, there's a lot to the Monster Hunter games. Okay. Now we can take on one star quests. She wants to talk Hello? to us. Welcome oh. back, la la la, the bunny dango, one uh -huh. star quest, kind of like a mountain, yeah, great. How are you today? Okay. We still have five to do. I'll be here if you need me. Alright, so the village progress is that we can take on uh one star quests. Let's go talk to Minoto. Hey! Hey! Minoto. How can I help you? Waiting for you. Gathered one star to start. Yeah, that's great. Mm -hmm. Knocked the ranks. Oh. Perfect. Quest uh -huh. board. Quest gate. Running at hubs. Getting a good luck. Hello. Okay. Um, the event is way over our head right now. Subquests are same as outside, so we still have five chosen. Mushrooms, bones, golden spear bug, hunting slaying. Um, but here, we can actually go on... Quest with other people um, I can actually join some people in here so on this one I could choose one of these everything from this hub from Minoto is uh, meant for four players that's what the tutorial said as we were going through <laughs> um, you could go and solo these if you are confident enough and prepared enough um, we're not prepared enough we have the basic gear on so if I were to jump into this quest from this menu um, drew all the monster pictures. Aren't they great? We'd have to, to we'd have to put, then. hey, someone come, please come join me. But, um, two ways. I can either go to my quest board from here and respond to a join request, level one, and then choose one of them, and we could jump in with someone else who's asked for help. Um, gosh, who do I want to do first? Uh, maybe... This guy's fun. So we're about to join in on someone else's quest right now. Hopefully it will go well. <laughs> it's one star, so they're meant for very beginner. I think he's number one, does he? Just because he snatched my gold gargua egg. Well, you're gonna show him, you got that? I'm number one around here. I'm number one. Kamura's number one egg lover. <laughs> All right, and we didn't eat, so I do wanna stop by. If I get one more tutorial in the next five minutes. Uh, pay with money, funny dango, and I'm gonna choose. Weapon retains sharpness, speeds up weapon sharpening, and uh, balancing. Register to set one. Yep. Order. Okay. We spend a lot of time doing that, but 
that gives you some um, boosts. I registered it so that next time that will be much, much quicker to do that. Let's get going. Go help him. He's not even fighting it yet, which is good. Oh, also, you can name your dog. So I'm on my own dog now. And if we were solo, we'd have a little um, cat running around with us that helps us fight. I named both the cat and the dog, the Palico and Palamute, after my animals. <laughs> um, I gave them some nicknames that I give my pets. This is Rocco. That's not his real name, but it's his nickname. Um, and my cat's name is... What's this? Uh, Bibu. Did someone leave? No, we're fine. Cat's name is Bibu. That's the, again, the nickname that I gave to my kitty cat. Sweet. Okay, I'm on my way, dude. He's getting impatient. Okay, got the fence up. He's fighting it. We could be killing all those, uh, things there, but... We'll get over here and help him. Alright. These are the hunting bases. Oh, oh god. Alright, so this is actually a, a bigger hunt. Oh god, he's pecking me. Alright, and so on this weapon I can do a health recovery, so that helps heal other people. Man, I'm whipping this guy like there's no, no business. Alright. Is he enraged? Oh, he pecked me. <laughs> Bow. 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 Yeah. Out of the way. Okay. He hit me with the rock. Let's do this, actually. This isn't good. Oh, help me. I can't see anything, and he's pecking me, and he's all over the place. Alright. Let's heal up. Okay, he dropped a part here, so I'm gonna grab that over here. Oh! No! What are we doing? Alright, we'll do our big... Pearl! 55 damage! Need more ammo. What am I playing with? Oh, uh, um, one of the guys is a bow. He just joined, though, I think. Okay. We have our big buff um, ready to go when we're ready, but I'm afraid he's gonna run soon. I'm not gonna do it now. Okay, he's on the ground, and then I will do this. Yes! So I buffed everyone and did a huge damage thing to him. And then we can also do. I got him. Good. 60. Good. Perfect! So we're gonna follow him, and one cool thing about this monster hunter is you can sharpen your weapon on the Alamut. <laughs> Let me grab all the stuff here. Mushroom. Alright. Where'd he go? There he is. Okay. 
Okay. to do that. Definitely hit him. But I got everyone a big buff. So now the rest of the group is going to be able to do some cool stuff. Hit big. Hey. I love this weapon. <laughs> I'm having so much fun with it. Uh, is this another monster here? I can ride this monster, by the way. Why burn right, sir? Riding the bear and killing the chicken. Okay, we almost are able to do a big. A big. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was sick. Parts we've got here that we broke off with the bear, man. Get the poop. Get that poop. All right, let's go. Sharpen. Where do you go up this way? I love this game. I'm having so much fun, and this weapon feels just so good playing it. Doing. <laughs> All right. Let's see how you handle this. 
Lots of damage. Oh God. Watch your health. Okay. That's, he's right. I should watch my health. <laughs> Getting greedy. He's, he's looking at me. Alright. Ow. Thank you. Okay. Is someone missing his attack book here? Oh god. What are we doing? Stop it. Wow, that was a big hit. <laughs> be getting down like this is insane Don't you peck at me sir almost got it okay capture him now if we want, but... No parts around here? Okay, let me get this honey real quick. And then sharpen while we're running. Alright, let's go finish him off, man. First hunt is a Kula Kula. I don't know what his name is, actually. <laughs> so, I don't know how you say his name. Wait, is this bear? Oh, he's sleeping. You guys want to capture him, or? No, we're going to kill him. Nope, he ran away too far. OK. Are we gonna kill the bear? No, but a piece of the bear broke off, so get that. <laughs> Are they back there killing the bear or no? No, they're coming up here. There we go. I finally got my dismount. Oh god, don't hit me with that rock, man. Insane. All right, let me get everyone's attack up there. Ow. Don't, don't you do that? Whatever you're doing, stop it. There you go. Okay, stay right there. Or not. Oh, well, we killed a little guy with it, but I wanted to buff everyone. I was hoping to do damage with it, too, but... Ow. Okay, I'm about to faint, so I need to go heal. Don't. Are we all in new gear? Is that what's like we're all brand new? I think so. Okay. Please do not, because I'm very close to dying here. I just 
counting on maybe he's ready to die too. Oh. oh, it's too far away from him. Oh god, the bear's here. <laughs> I just saw a bear butt go running through the screen. <laughs> we go okay he's dead and then you can give everyone a like oh we only had three people that might be why we're having trouble there all right now we carve him oh god okay that guy is a monster we're gonna fight but we are he better stay right over there let me tell don't you do it if he lands on our head we're dead Okay, we got some hides. You won't be needing got this. Some skin. Looking forward to hunting with you. Yeah. All right, Kula Kula. Wait, Kula Yaku. I call him Kula Kula. <laughs> All right, cool. And then you got you know 50 seconds to go carve, go gather anything close by, and then it takes you automatically back to the village. And that's the gist of Monster Hunter, really. Um, I love this game. And I, I don't know, like I said, I don't know how far we're going to take it playing on the channel. Um, but, I mean, far. <laughs> Definitely play it a while. Alright, we got a Kula Kula beak. Scales and hides. Alright. And a bunch of mushrooms. And a ton of money, and a ton of points. Friend points. Rocco leveled up. Cool. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Yo, Ace. What's up, my dude? Hey there! I've been waiting for you. That's one of my favorite people. Look at a hundred coming in later. Arena quest, arena quest, challenge quest. Ah, Great. Stay out Perfect. <laughs> I'm sure you had something really important to say, but let's turn in a I've side quest we got done. Just one, huh? Large monster hunting. Until next time. Okay, and then uh, what I want to do before we end our first episode of Monster Hunter. Oh, we got a ton of people that want to talk to us, huh? Hey, got something for you. Good to see you, Vesper Valentina. How's the hunting life treating you? There's something I'd like you to do, on top of your normal monster hunting duties, that is. If you ever hear of any villager having trouble, I want you to lend him an ear. If you can help, lend him a hand, too. I know it's all of a sudden all, but don't worry, I got something nice and easy to get you used to it. Need you to bring me back something. He wants a well done steak, and I have 40 of them. And just free potions. Oh. I will take free potions. Alright, you have something to discuss. I'm sure you do, because I got some parts now. Come to me if you need new gear. So, the reason we carve things, I'll explain these tutorials, is you can make new gear and new weapons. Jesus. Um, this is what we currently have equipped. It says E on there. To upgrade it, we need one piece of iron ore, which we haven't found. Uh, we also have question mark, question mark tree, which means it's a beast that we haven't killed yet. Um, iron ore, we could make this one. We got, oh, we can make the bone one. What does the bone one do? Beast makes waste. Take all the time Environment you need. damage negated, defense up, attack up. I gotta figure out what environment damage is. Defense up, attack up. I would like the attack up to be X and A, because that's the one I feel like I use the most. Let's make it! No, problem. no point not making it, huh? Sure, well, now we got a bone one. So that's the uh, weapon, but you also ready. 
can make a ton of armor. So we currently have Kamura armor equipped and you can see what it looks like. We could make leather armor um, if we had some like pelts and stuff. This is what that would look like. We can make Kula armor. Um, what does it have on it? What does the whole set have on it? Might a, a horn maestro. Oh. No need to hurry. There's Lugger plenty stamina, of time. Which one has horn maestro on it? This one. I need a plume. So we'd go have to go hunt that monster again and get a plume. To uh to make the shirt, which I want for Horn Maestro. That would be pretty nice. Okay. Yeah. So that, oh, look at our new <laughs> our new horn, our bone horn. Oh my gosh. Alright, well that's Monster Hunter in a nutshell. Um, like I said, we're gonna be playing this on the channel. Uh I, I, again, I don't know how far. I don't know what the uh, end game looks like. I don't know what, you know, what we want to do with it. If we want to do more than one weapon, hunting horn is a lot of fun. Insect glaive, um, I really like it, but I'm bad at it. <laughs> um, hey, what do you got here? Hey, you. Oh, I know what this is. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. So guys, let me know what you think. If you want to see more of the Monster Hunter Rise Let's Play. Again, I know I went through the beginning of this really fast, but I did want to get a hunt done um, in this first episode. Otherwise, we would be not even seeing monsters until like two or three episodes in. <laughs> uh, but we're here now and we're ready to hunt and ready to grind and ready to skin and ready to forge. <laughs> So guys, I want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Monster Hunter Rise Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Alright, bye-bye everyone.